clearly right. You got it. <laughs> I mean, you gotta look at it with respect, correct. but also like <laughs> at the same time, you gotta be like, you don't be pulling him out. Let me show you how this guy works. <laughs> Let me show you how this character works, bro. Oh, the backer took the jump. That's unfortunate. I wonder if it re uh, Leo realized that doesn't go for the down gun, so I guess he didn't. Yeah, Omega Ooh. will be looking for those cheeky down guns, though. Uh, you can see the familiarity. It's in the little interactions, yeah. right? Upper drag down's not going to work. A little bit of SDI coming out from Omega there. Sorry, <laughs> the red each and other. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oh, the footstool guns! Oh Crap. my that god! Was, oh my god! Y'all do oh not know god. how hard that can That's be. some new stuff. That can be. No, no. We we pin no. We pin no. Now we got two ghosties out here right now. You Pretty my ass too hard. One. My dad's here. Turns out <laughs> it's bring your father to school day. Don't talk to me or my son ever again. Very right. nice, patient Packer coming out there from Omega. There Omega looking is clean. I gotta no say the movement is so good. I was just going to say no Arsene from Leo, but actually farms a Rebel's Guard. Oh, the footstool coming out. I don't know if you guys heard it. A little sneaky, a little sneaky. What fast-paced action we've had this Was entire top 128 so far, bro. All right, they're both looking for their right. confirm right here. Dog. Looking for the falling fair. fair. Very nice fair back onto the map from Omega. Going to seal out that early stock. This can be a bit of a hard spot for Joker where yeah. you're having to settle for, you know, light taps. Uh, fortunately, Joker gets the edge guard himself harder Whoa. than almost any other character in the cast. That downer was crazy. Just settle for the down guns, please. You'll kill. This Sorry. is like the most in there I've seen Leo go. Though. He's smelling blood on these edge guards. He's going for it. He's diving <laughs> for silver. The wave bounce. A little... Aha trade, beautiful. Still though, every Aha Omega lands is just helping him more and more. And I gotta say, the movement and mix-ups Omega is having. We're, we're in the new gen. Yeah. This is some new gen Joker. Yeah, this is old school Joker versus new school Joker. This ain't your dad's Joker. To see, but you know, a oh, lot of people say, you know, fundies conquers all, right? So, does Omega have the fundies required to make use of all these new techniques, to make use of all this stuff that the Joker player base has found? Or is the OG still just the GOAT? There's one thing I gotta say, Leo is the master of taking things back to neutral. I gotta say, he knows how to just slow it down mid-range and deploy like Aha or Gun, just to check the opponent into like, no, we're done here. You're gonna have to come at me once again to get things started once again. Yeah. I'm not like, gonna, look at that. Look I'm at the not gonna rush it. I'm not gonna rush my advantage if I don't have to. You're gonna work to get out of this corner every time. And Omega kind of tapped into that as well. You see these good spacings. That Joker, uh, the Arsene F tilt, second hit is there for, I forget exactly how many, I want to say six It waves. lingers. It's Damn. there. Uh, so it's really hard to escape the corner versus the repetition of that attacker. Big Trump coming out from Omega. Joker's Trump borderline. It's so unreactable. It's so Borderline good. unreactable because he of the gets there so quick. It is instantaneous if you're standing on the ledge. That was a Great really nice damage. conversion there coming from Omega making use of that early stuff. But Leo going, you beat my ass, perhaps a little too hard. Dad my dad is back here, again. and he doesn't like that. He actually really doesn't like that. This is pretty good, though, honestly. Good longevity on the stock for Omega, and the Arsene meter is building up once again. Once Omega makes it back to stage, he's about to have Arsene if Leo doesn't take this stock off right now. And Leo's is trickling down to the very... Big okay, rising though. near the ledge. Good. Very cheeky stuff. Doesn't look for the down air, just looks for full spatial coverage, and it actually does work out. The classic Leo combo, not looking for drag downs or anything fancy, but instead just Ooh. a simple three-piece and corner control. Oh, Mega does find the dash attack out of the corner there. All right, though, back to neutral. Some slam poetry going on here with all the snapping. Leo, though, has center stage, but oh, this is huge, though. No Arsene just yet on Leo, but that Omega Arsene is looking so good right now. And Leo is looking pretty ripe for a stock being taken right here. Yeah. But Easy Omega pickings. Kind of catching on to some of these habits, if you really look, right? Some of these shield habits, some of these spot dodge habits, and getting really patient, slightly whiffing some things, but it is still working. Oh, but this is Leo, though. You can't just kind of, you can't let him play his game. Omega kind of letting him get Ooh, away with it. The foot Whoa, that if doesn't. He, if he caught the direction correctly on the tech roll there, that was game. Not looking for up smash, maybe overcomplicating it a little bit. And now this is so scary for Omega on ledge against Arsene, and the Arsene I feel is gonna yep. be enough in the tech down angle F tilt. That move is gonna blow you up. Doesn't matter who you are. And the messed up thing is at that rage with Arsene, Joker <laughs> can just follow you with up guns yeah. in the ditto, and you can't do anything. It's true. So.
Just, just complete, good edge complete right nil here. situation. Again, Leo's clutch gene just really consistent. Um, the reaction to that neutral getup as well, too. Very yeah. good to use down angle and F-tail in that situation. Because, I mean, like you said, it lingers. Yes. It is such a very reliable tool to catch that option specifically. Yep. Omega having shines of brilliance, but Le Leo is the clutch god for a reason, bro. Yeah. You gotta be able to... Oh, no! <laughs> Does a footstool gun just to be like... You kids, <laughs> you kids aren't the only ones. I hope you know. I hope you know I've been practicing He's on his porch shaking too. his face like, you damn kids, I was no doing this before you were. Yeah. Hope you know they sent me this. They DM'd me this. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. That is, it's it's got to be very reliable to be the top rep of your character because you're like, yo, man, I was laughing this out for like 24 oh. hours. You want to use this? Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't look for the second rep of down guns. I noticed these two not... Um, not fully pushing at the ledge at times, and I wonder if it's a comfort thing or if it's a knowledge thing. It could be also that they don't get want to get reversal in a situation like that. Both yeah. of these guys playing very close to the ledge, and they both have very good ledge play. Yes, so. exactly. and Joker has the hitboxes to edge guard effectively as well, so definitely a little bit of care being put. That being said, big up smash whiff right there, and Leo is looking very comfortable with stage control much. right now. Leo's eagerness to get back to center stage is always so impressive to me. He always knows not to get absorbed into the scramble. Yeah. He always knows how to just keep things favorable for himself in neutral. This is something you don't see out of all players, I feel like. Yeah. And that's got to be weird to deal with in a matchup like the Joker did. Yeah, right? for sure. When you're at like mid range, everything is yeah, a scramble. Exactly. You're always getting hit, whether you're at mid range, mostly full range. Yeah. This character just has a lot of threats. And Omega trying Very to force nice. his way back in, but Leo has been so good at ledge. Was that jab two? It was jab three. Jab uh, three, okay. Jab two. It was, I was like, jab Joker's two can't jab do that. doesn't work sometimes. It doesn't work sometimes. It's yeah. a very weird move. Settles for the dash attack, knowing that Omega's looking for the jump out of shield. That's a big sign of comfort coming out from Leo. And that's got to be scary as Omega. These little things racking up. Does find the backer. 26 isn't hard. Omega keeping a tit for tat, though. You know, he's really just not trying to let Leo uh, run away with this uh, lead. Yep. All right, go. And he's got good early conversions right here. We're going to be seeing some nice damage. Tried to maybe go for a little bit of an air dodge punish right there. Didn't think they could get another bear going. Ooh. Omega looking good, though. Arsene in tow. <sighs> so, oh, my God. That was so scary for Leo. Does manage to get out of the corner. Omega could have snapped there, though. Nice Does catch. get caught. I'm surprised that didn't kill. One Both thing I think that's differentiating these two players right here is Leo's ledge trapping versus Omega. Yes. It's Leo's looking a lot better. Like, I don't think I've seen a single successful conversion from Omega's ledge trapping here. Yes. And that is, that in this in a ditto, that is what will net you a lot of stocks, especially the Joker ditto. What yeah. a weird interaction would that all be right oh. there. Oh, whoa. Leo's presence during that combo is so beautiful. Manages to keep it going. The pressure's still landing gone to stay in that corner. Dash attack going to get onto the next landing gun, though. Omega not nice. giving it up so easily. A hot to the corner. The tick is going to be a lot here. Could just settle it with. Oh! Wow, back air parries. off the double parry would have been crazy, but unfortunately not quite working out. That within throw kill percent right here. Omega has a lot of win conditions, I feel like, at the helm right here. Good nair, though, to get the stage control. Oh, Honestly, enough to admit. I like that he back aired there still, even though it gave Leo our set because it still gave him stage control. Yep. All right, now, now Omega in the lead for the first time. Yeah, this is a big spot, right? You have to make the most here. That was a beautiful attempt right there, but unfortunately doesn't get the call. It's Shoot a little him. bit hard to place <laughs> on the juggle with Joker. You have to be so finite in where you place yourself. So in a matchup with Joker, who lands so easily, it can get really rough, right? This is so good, though. I mean, yeah, look at how Omega's the taking the double R set right now. He's yep. shooting the gun. And every every little bit of damage Joker takes, it decreases oh. the R set meter even faster. Little bit of time to milk it. We've seen Leo do it before, but the landing gun gonna take our scent away. A lot of pressure in this corner here. Omega's still with a comfortable lead. Yeah. Leo not really able to make much work. No Doesn't get the up smash scoop off the ground. Whoa, looking for a gun lock across the stage. Omega again, shysty with it. A little bit of comfort oh, here. Whoa! No. Just do the jab lock sometimes. I understand though. To be Omega fair, you, for you gotta different. react to that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Because you don't know if that's going to pop them up or pop them down because you can catch a jump in like less than a second. Yep. You got to really be thanking your stars and guys. Excellent up tilt right there the to catch the landing. Tilt. Very nice. I think 
Joker's most slept on move. Yo, look at the water I will cups. actually say, <laughs> whoa, it's beautiful. Yo. <laughs> I will say it with full confidence, up tilt is Joker's most slept on move. That move I is agree. low key crazy. It's a good landing catcher. It's a good thing to wrap up games. Uh, a lot of characters will try to land on Joker because they think the, mo the most active move he can do to catch me in this situation is Nair. Nah, bro, that, if, if you get caught in that, it scoops. Yeah, and if you think about Joker's bubble, right? The hardest spot for Joker to actively control is directly above, above him, his yeah. head. You know, unless you're off. getting the upper out in time. Up till crouches and then puts a <laughs> disjointed <laughs> knife that hangs out there for a little while. <laughs> the hydration station is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, though. These two Japanese teenagers duking it out once again with guns, curse moves on Pokemon Stadium too. Looking good for Omega though, showing that I still I still got some fight left in me and honestly yep. looking very, very comfortable towards the end of that game right there. Very, yeah. very comfortable with playing the lead. And that's that's something hopefully Leo can start doing as the, the set progresses. Yep. And we saw, you know, beginning of that game, we saw Leo making a lot of decisions that seemed like playing with his food a little bit, right? Oh! oh, oh. That would have been raw. Yeah, that would have been insane. Fire. Big push here from... It's so hard to follow these jokers sometimes. The skins look the same. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> Colorblind is I wish our my was. Right I, I wish our scent was different. <laughs> I wish our scent was like a... Like our, our scent was like bright pink or something. Who's dead? They both have the same dad, man. <laughs> yeah, <they both> <laughs> <have> <laughs> Ooh, big landing gun there coming out from Omega. A lot of value. What I was saying earlier oh, is that... Oh, I love that. That's my favorite thing. Full cross up, down air. Up it smash, just looks so beautiful yeah. every time. Yeah, looking for the up smash. Unfortunately, only gets the third hit of the up air. Yeah, so you need to scoop that, that locks him down onto yep. the platform. Or else you're not getting that up smash. Which is so sad. Ooh, big guns. Important to be patient there for Leo. Just recognize the situation. You are under the platform. You don't have to overcommit. But the full hop gun's approaching from Omega. Big push. And we see there one of the pitfalls, you know, in the Joker dichotomy right here is that he doesn't have a very good out of shield game you yes. cannot really you're gonna have to get slapped on the wrist a lot of the times because yeah. you're not gonna be able to get that solid punish and i think leo knows that which is why he's playing so scrappy with omega right wow. now despite being a kill percent he knows that omega really can't find a solid answer out of shield unless he has something long. huge waiting a little bit too long there perhaps or maybe a little bit of hurt box shenanigans does finally find that backer in the corner. Omega needs to make a lot happen to bring this back. I'm just sad one of these two players has to take each other out, man. Yeah, it's so I, I need to see more Whoa, Joker. Big jab right. up there. Big push Whoa. from Omega finds another there. That was good. Sign Even though it was life. a little bit of damage, that was a very good conversion because a lot of players probably would have just jab locked. That's match right there. Yeah, exactly. You know, you can settle for the simple things or you can max out. And there are times where both are important. But if you're looking for a big comeback, right, you're about to have Arsene. You want to max out as hard as you possibly can with non-Arsene Joker. The positioning here looking terrifying for Leo. Yeah, the Nair connects. Scary. Is the downer going to connect? Not quite yet. Omega not oh, fishing. The yo. drag down up air. The corner pressure is crazy. Great fair right there, too, to catch the air dodge. Especially oh. since... Oh my God, Still not fishing, that. finds the back air though! The lowest bear of all time. And again, take note, Omega saving that downer, right? Really noting what perfect timing. We are probably gonna see it before the end of the set at least once. And Omega has been very good with playing with the lead throughout the duration of this entire set so far. Gonna opt to keep that healthy mid-range between him and Leo. Kind of baiting Leo in there. He thought he could punish that AHA, but he couldn't. Oh, Excellent yep. drag Settling down. Settling for the down, the down smash. smash. Yep, gotta do that. If the character is crouching under your jab lock or weird things are happening. He switched up settle. too. Yep. Leo's been going for up smash most of the times when getting that. He immediately just pulled the trigger on down smash. Very good adaptation on his part. On the spot adjustment is beautiful to see. Great cognizance. Another AHA trade. So much Crazy cursing. looking game. Both dads are here. Oh my god. Oh my god. And what they're is both happening? taking so much residual damage. This is getting scarier by the second. Omega! Oh, oh my god. Big push from Omega, but possibly SDI up from Leo there. All right, though. This is scary Ooh. as hell. Does look for Omega's the down dad is still Finds here. Finds the back air, and it's going to connect. Omega getting 2 1. Finally cleans it up. Leo. So what I was saying at the beginning of that game, you know, during game two, we saw Leo playing around a little bit with the food, looking for the footstool, saying, I could do this new tech too, kid. Yeah. You're not you're not a, anything special. You guess I'm Omega is like... I'm my chest out, but Omega is... He's the new kid on the block. I mean, he's been playing Joker for a hot minute, but he has really Joker. taken the time to master all the tech. And Joker has not had like a, a huge hero with a huge solo rep, I should say. Leo's been opting for the Joker finally again. Yes. 
But these new kids are really just trying to push this character's meta as hard as he can. And Leia, Leia, this old dog has got to learn some new tricks if he's going to want to keep up. Because uh, Omega's on the verge of running away and putting another upset on the board and putting Big another upbeat, killer no losing jump, bracket. But Leo only settles for the for the platform tech Ooh. chase there. Actually, really interesting. Hold on now. 109 uncontested until that nair. We have game four Leo. Oh, big push from Leo. Actually, we do. You know. And everyone caught my call. I wish it wasn't like. And everyone might call it dead. I wish it wasn't like proven. Yeah. Statistically, the game five. They made four a whole ass video on that. That's so crazy. Oh uh, yeah. Again, we see it's hard to juggle sometimes in this matchup, though. Both it's just because the hitbox is so small. Joker is so skinny. Yes. You can't hit him that easily. But still, Leo turning a different tempo right now. He is applying the gas right now. Still the big whiff up air right here. Yeah, really important to make something happen here for Omega. If you can get rid of this Arsene without taking damage or possibly even kill here, that's going to be a big mental detriment to Leo. That Aha shifted the hard box just ever so slightly on the F tilt. That was a Nixie fair. That was a Nixie <laughs> Nair with Joker fair. That was beautiful right there. I love those. That's cool. All right, the, wow, Leo finding the grab right there on the landing. He knows that Omega's been trying to do some... Every Joker player, I think, tries to do some sort of mix-up on landing because he's not always the safest. And he knows and he knows that you can't have the safest out of shield punish, so you can afford to do a mix-up after that to try and dodge the, the returning hit. All right, a lot the, of just what dashback patience. turnaround, just waiting for that next beat, waiting to see what the other person commits to. Shades of Melee Zane, honestly, yes. with Leo. Like, but Leo is the, the, the mid-range master, honestly, with this character. He yes. really knows how to just pause his tempo completely and disrupt it. And you can tell Omega's having a, a ton of trouble with it this game. Yeah. All, All right. Finally find something. That fair upper going to work out. 133 is rough, but our send right around the corner. If Omega can make something happen early here, we might see something beautiful. It is so impressive to me how Joker players know that they have to switch their potential to a dime. And it's so, parry, so crazy. Recognition that it wasn't a real punish off the parry. Also, yes, God, the on the spot adjustment from characters like this, I love it. The Joker's, in the moment the shoots, to get a different hit out is crazy. Yeah. Just like, oh, I'm in the wrong spot, I think. <laughs> yeah, let me fix that <laughs> real quick. Like, yeah. Let me readjust. Hands, go. <laughs> All right, though. Residual damage taking away. I mean, look at Omega using these Arsene guns to just take away uh, Leo's persona meter. It's very, very scary. Still, though, very Leo important. has a lot in the avenue of getting that kill, as we see uh, right there. Still, though, Arsene gone. It's the same combo with Dad present. That's kind of crazy. That is crazy. One, two. Dad knows you've had the TV oh, the on. jump guns. Leo looking for something a little bit shicey here. Oh. Does get the back air. Aha not going to connect here. Doesn't look for jump guns again. Alex to look oh for the nair ledge trap. Doesn't quite get it. Leo even guessed correctly, but it traded, which was crazy. But he that still managed to get that damage. That was crazy He could have exploded for that, but the sheer confidence from Leo. You can't be afraid, man. Not, not when you're one game off. Okay, a little, little twerking. Checking, yeah. Uh -uh. Let it work a little bit. <laughs> Throwing it back a little bit. Oh my god, Le again. Leo, quick on the trigger. He is not missing those anymore. Where we saw some little bit of hesitation towards the beginning of the set, he knows now. Good He's up. locked in. Yep. Good off air. Also recognizing the spots where Omega is electing to come down with button versus air dodge. The RPS on the recess. Looking very comfortably in Leo's favor. He's trying to go for the point. jab block, but it missed. Yeah, the timing messed up. Are set up on both sides. Both dads here at the playground, ready to scrap with each other. Yep. What did you call my son? <laughs> I'll kill oh, you. Oh, he's dead. Dude. Oh, big down smash there. Omega with signs of life here. Half the meter to go. If you wait all that I time on that. the platform, you only have a second of invincibility. Leo knows this and runs away. Omega does find the hit, though. A little bit less than a quarter of that meter left. What's going to happen? Omega trying to push. Leo running away, milking that time. Episode okay. found. All right, though, but a little bit of time left, and Leo has the meter halfway filled up at this point, and the residual damage of the Aha is going to build it up. That's a crazy back air right there. The wavelength and everything. That was beautiful. Finally looking for that. Down guns and traps off the ledge. He's Leo so looking good. so he comfortable. He's so good at ledge trapping. It's yep. ridiculous. It. And in, in, it. in this matchup where your hits are not going to be plentiful, finding the most consistent hits at ledge, which is probably statistically where most players have the most difficulty finding that extra hit. Yes. 
That is that is all the better for Leo in this scenario. Now we're at a hot game five. It's duo die for Omega. Still looking pretty locked in though. Still looking pretty comfortable. Still looks confident, and that's really you look important, good. right? It's so you easy. Look good. You look good. <laughs> it's so easy to get shook the second something like that happens. It's so easy to say to yourself, "Oh, I got game for Leo." We all know it happens next, but Omega's <laughs> shaking it off. Everyone's human, right? Yeah, it's true. We all lose. Yep. Good oh fair boy, off the though. ledge. Leo getting oh a lot of Oh my god, he's, he's in. He's tapped yeah. in. These are only options you can Ooh. do if you know what the opponent's disadvantage uh, is, and Omega is... Omega you know, wanted double Nair, didn't quite get it. I think you noted earlier, like, Joker, Joker players, when they eat it, they eat it. Like, it's hard to hit Joker, but Joker players aren't really used to getting hit a lot. And what yes. they do in that disadvantage state, that's scary. you got to really be able to mix it up, but it's kind of hard. It's yeah. kind of hard to find those mix-ups. Joker... Joker's disadvantage is low-key pretty samey most of the time. It is. And the problem is, like, there are characters where you can kind of fall back on Rebel's Guard at times. Yeah. But Joker's so quick, so snappy, that the positioning is usually not really going to end up in your favor if you fish for a Rebel's Guard, right? Leo! 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 Big Leo! Omega! Cats Omega! There. Lego! <laughs> yeah, Lego! My bad, my bad, my bad. <laughs> my fault, OG. <laughs> my I, I wasn't familiar with your game. Big fan of that rising full hop gun. Such a nice way to shift your timing on the landing out of the full hop for a character that has already a, a Link style 90% fastfall, right? So you oh, have mix. Oh no, the most unfortunate. Oh my god, Omega looking so comfortable. That up B is going to make you eat it though. Oh. Saves the jump. Unfortunately, eats the second down. round of guns. That's the first time that happens this whole set. And that's good, honestly. Leo had to end it there because we know how well Omega plays with the lead in this matchup. Yep, Omega taking notes from Leo's approach to the Arsene, though. Running away, just yep. letting this last half of the meter get milk. Wait no for need that to, rush to go this. away. And Let on top of this, when you come fresh off the platform, right, you're going to have Arsene on off yeah. timing now. It's true. That's true. There is a certain tempo to Arsene yes. as well. That you have, and there's a timing to when he's going to come out and when he's not going to come out. And I, I love stalling out almost disrupts that pattern. Yeah. Very consistently. It is important to recognize where it places you relative in the ditto, though, because things can get dicey. But now the meter is pretty much equal. And Leo with a bit of a lead, both in meter and in percent. Things looking a little bit scary for Omega here. Big fair he one, f -smash. He doesn't miss those anymore, Oh, and the taunt. Leo looking to get into his opponent's head a little bit. Still no rare. Good opportunity for Omega to get it back. The meters are pretty even on both sides, and that percentage is looking higher and higher. This is Omega's time to steal this game right back. Yes, right back. Looking for the backer again. Not confident in these down guns, but Leo picking angles that would lose. Omega, okay, possibly Again, selling though, the bag a little the bit. The ledge trapping being his his kryptonite, man. He cannot yeah. get a single advantage state right there. And in this ditto, that is so important. Yeah, I mean it's it's hard, right? Because Leo has it down to a science yeah, where Leo will true, too. do something that forces you to buffer, cover your common buffered option. You got to react. That forces you to buffer, cover your common buffered option, and so you're forced to constantly react. Unfortunately, it looks like Omega hasn't really found that that same timing, that thing that he needs to do to just get the timing down Whoa. back to hard punish Can't the buffered again, option though. every time. Can't do that again. The backer doesn't connect. Omega gonna settle for a forward throw. Down throw gonna be killing soon. Still though, he did that to wait out the last little trickle backer of our set. Yes. That was very smart on Leo's part. Good this eye. has become Good a whole eye. inner meta game of just close the DS, pretend to sleep so dad leaves the room, then he can open that up again and play yeah, Pokemon. exactly. We can play hard gold later. <laughs> dad might beat our ass. Omega, do you have that dog in you, or will the goat come off the perch? Will Very he come nice. off the top of the mountain? Great call out from ah, oh, Leo just so good at the ledge trap. It's so crazy. I think that's Omega a difference maker catches the neutral game. Constantly getting called. Omega yeah, that flabbergasted true. at that yeah, one. <laughs> a good set. Neutral respect from both players. Stand proud. You can cook. Yeah, you can cook. That was a beautiful showing from Omega. Do not go down into losers with your head in your yeah. hands after a performance like oh, that. No, I low key wouldn't this losers bracket. <laughs> yeah, I'm low this key. This is a little scary. Like, it's so horrifying down there. So many killers. I'm going to pull up the bracket. Let's see. I'm very happy, though, to see, see a Leo dub. You know, Leo. No, oh, yeesh. 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 <laughs> little shysty. Little shysty. Little shysty. Little scary. <laughs> Good catch, Devin. Good <laughs> catch. <laughs> Very nice. That's why Devin's the best in the business, honestly. That is production goats. Yeah. Production goats. <laughs> that kid kind of got it, though. <laughs> 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 kind of. 
The kid's kind of dirty. <laughs> oh, I said. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, good games, man. good games, man. Good games, yeah. man. Good Honestly, games. really good. <laughs> Holy moly. <laughs> Fight for my fucking life out here. <laughs> 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 what the fuck happened? God damn. I used to win that shit for free back Are the in good times day. still rolling? Yeah. Are we still get some good times rolling here? Oh, yeah. Oh, look at what we got next. Look at what we got next. We are. Um, num, 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 num. We have. For you gamers, Tweak versus Tilde, a great showcasing of local talent. A little New York, New Jersey beef. Whew, Tilde, you know him. It's the Falco legend. One of the sauciest players to ever touch the sticks in this game. Bro, Falco on the trenches. Yeah, hit by things we didn't even know existed. Riptide, 20.